Hello everyone. I welcome you all to ATM Creations. This is a 20 inch MDF base in which as usual I found the center, drew circles and uh, created grids. And angles are marked at every 15 degree here. So 15, 30, 45, 60, 75, 90, 105, 120, 135, 150, 165. 0 and 180 falls here and in similar fashion I have marked the angles in this part of the circle too. Now generally I create a painting and then I sell it too but this is the first time I am recording a video um, and this is already sold out and I am preparing this for a client order. Let's get started with dotting. I will start with dotting in the center in gold. I will keep some dots in sky blue. I'll keep tiny dots now. Now I'll keep some dots in a lighter shade of light blue that I created. If you noticed for the previous circle of dots also I used the same tool. But the size of the dot is smaller earlier but bigger now. So it all depends on how much amount of paint you pick up with the tool. So with the same sized tool you can produce different sized dots. Now I'll keep tiny dots. Now I'll keep some dots with light blue. This is the actual light blue shade that I have. For the previous one, I mixed white with this light blue. Now I'll keep some tiny dots. Now I'll keep some dots in cerulean blue. Now I'll keep tiny dots. I'll keep some golden dots now. Now I'll keep two side swipes for every golden dot here. Now I'll keep some sky blue dots. Now I'll keep two side swipes in light blue. I'll keep dots twice so that I create a plumpy dot and I'll have enough paint to drag it as a swipe. I'll keep another dot, drag a little then drag completely. I'll repeat the process now with explanation. I'll keep one dot, I'll keep another dot, drag a little bit and then drag completely. I'll keep two more side swipes in cerulean blue.
I'll keep some golden dots now. I've left this place empty because once the painting is fully dry, I'm going to place some mirrors here. So I'm keeping this empty. I'll keep some golden dots now. I'll keep some tiny dots now. Now I'll keep some straight swipes in a particular shade of blue. After keeping some straight swipes with my tool, I decided to keep a dot then make it to a swipe because that gives me a lot of control over the shape of the swipe. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. You will now see few of my swipes at my original speed. Yes, there are a lot of uh, viewers and subscribers have asked me what exactly is your origin original speed of painting. So I thought I'll show you today. Nobody paints at uh, the speed that is shown in the video. This 20 inch MDF board actually takes somewhere between 3 to 4 hours for me to finish. But you all see it uh, somewhere within 20 to 25 minutes. So this is the time that I take for each and every swipe to make it from a dot to a swipe. And you have to show extreme patience in doing it. We cannot be in a hurry and still expect a great outcome. I'll keep the remaining swipes now. Now I'll keep some more side swipes in cerulean blue in between any two swipe here. Now I'll make these dots into swipes.
I'll keep some golden dots now. I'll keep some tiny dots now. Now I'll place some golden dots. Now I'll keep some sky blue dots. I'll keep some golden dots now. Now I'll keep some dots in light blue. I'll walk the dots in sky blue. I'll now walk the dots using light blue. I'll walk the dots in gold now. Now I'll keep some golden dots. I'll keep some created blue shade dots. Walk the dots now.
while it keeps on selling blue dots. Now I'll work the dots using cerulean blue. Now I'll keep some golden dots. I'll keep some blue dots now. I'll work the dots third layer now. Now I'll work the dots using gold. Now I'm going to let this uh, painting dry for at least 48 hours and then varnish it. After spray varnishing, I'll again dry it for 24 hours, then fix the mirrors here. So I'm going to fix the mirrors here and in this place too and also here. I'll show you all this process too. So this painting is fully dry now. Uh, varnish is dry too. So now it's the time to fix mirrors. I'm going to fix the mirrors in all these empty places here. So I'll place Fevicol first. I'll place mirrors now. Now as a next step, I'm going to place mirrors in between any two patterns here. I'll place Fevicol first.
I'll put Fevicol in all these places and place mirrors. I'll place hexagon shaped mirrors alternatively. In the remaining places, I'll place heart shaped mirrors. I'm sure after placing the mirrors, this mandala looks even more shiny and beautiful. Thank you for watching this video.